Next up then, Eddie Hall. Now, how is he going to fare leading the event and being chased? And he knows he's got the title holder, Lawrence Charlet, up against him. And Eddie Hall paid no attention whatsoever to his rivals in the last couple of events. Charlet just completely blanked Terry Hollands in the deadlift. So for these two men, Colin, it's all going to be about the internal focus. Yeah, Charlie's definitely more experienced. You can see he's snapping it out with his legs. Eddie Hall taking a lot longer of be getting it off his shoulder. He obviously doesn't feel that comfortable. Nearly halfway through, Lawrence Charlet to four. If he can keep that pace up for remaining 30 seconds, he'll be doing very well. Insanely, he's got the lead, and Eddie Hall, our overall leader on three, really could do with at least one more haul. Charlet goes to six for the individual lead on this event. Hall really needs to power this one out. If you can't blow too early, he gets the fourth, and I think he's going to call it a day. The time is up anyway. Well, maybe that was a good decision by him. Lawrence Charlet, he knew was going to beat him anyway. And that is a really vital win for our title holder. So the defending champion shows the up-and-comer how it's done. A first event win for Lawrence Charlet with an impressive six reps. Hollands takes second place with Hicks and Hall level on four reps. And that makes things even tighter at the top in the overall standings now, with Charley moving up to tie Graham Hicks for second place, and now only three points separating Hollands in fourth from the leader, Eddie Hall. Let's hear now what Lawrence thought of his own performance. Lawrence Charley, six repetitions. You're 20 kilograms lighter, but it's not affected your overhead strength. Um, yeah, surprised myself there. Pressing hasn't been as good as I'd like in training. Obviously, losing a bit of weight has um, affected certain areas and hopefully improved others but um training on the dumbbell has not been that good i've got a dumbbell 100 kilos but it's a bit different i've only been getting about three reps with it so really happy with six that's brilliant and it's so awkward we've seen so many guys get zero repetitions what's the difficulty with the shape of the weight it's the, the size of it it's 100 kilos it's like 16 stone sat on your shoulder trying to press that kind of weight overhead it's Although it's on one arm, it's a whole body exercise. But the most important thing is getting the dumbbell balanced. If that starts moving, you never get it. And um, that actual dumbbell suited me pretty well. I found it quite comfortable. Now, what would it mean to be British champion for the third year in a row? Oh, it's why I do this. I, um, you know, I want to be the best in the country. The standard in England just keeps getting better and better. Um, I've been working hard to try and um, kind of set myself a long-term goal of trying to get in better shape. And, you know, I think realistically, I'll be where I need to be in about another year's time. But um, standard's so high. You just got to try and fight with every event. That's all I ever do. Brilliant crowd here today as well. Fantastic. You know, all of us appreciate these guys coming down, supporting us on each event. And, um, you know, I know myself definitely, but I know all the guys do. Every single one of them appreciates your support. So thank you for that.